I'm Robert Greist, and I'm here to speak on the shape of things to come. Engineering and mathematics have always co-evolved, engineering using mathematics as an engine of inspiration and computation, witness calculus, linear algebra, probability, and more. But what is the shape of things to come? What is the next branch of useful mathematics? Where will it come from? Where it always comes from. Abstract, obtuse, jabberwockish, mysteria mathematicae. If you look at integrals, eigenvalues, Fourier transforms, bifurcations, martingales, and more, they all started off as abstract nonsense, and they all ended happily ensconced in the engineering undergraduate curriculum. So what's next? What is that next indispensable branch of mathematics that we can use to tackle the problems of the big, from data to nets to bots to brains? I believe that the most useful, least used branch of mathematics is topology, the mathematics of shape and space. Topology, which counts and correlates the global holes in a space, is singularly well suited to the age of data that we inhabit. Work at Penn is already applying topology to problems in sensor networks, in robot motion planning, in target tracking, and more. Currently, researchers at Penn and elsewhere are using topological data analysis to infer wiring structure in neurons, to determine protein compressibilities, and more. Topology thus answers both what is the shape of a thing and what is the shape of things to come? Thank you.